The only way to truly communicate is to get together, sit down, face to face, have a beer, have a drink, have some food together, and truly interact. It's heartwarming to see people, you know, talking across the table and not just texting and checking Facebook. Yeah. Alright, that is the sour okay, and this is the market. They're having conversations. They're they're using the space the way I could only dream that they would, which is to get together with their friends and talk. My name is Dave Longbottom. I am the founder and president of Flora Hall Brewing. Although we are certainly foremost a brewery, for me it's more about the getting the people together. So what we're trying to create here with Flora Hall is a, a true gathering spot, uh, almost a community center in Centertown. So why Centertown? A lot of it was driven by this building that we're sitting in. It's a fabulous heritage structure that I found when I started to think about doing this business. I looked around the city, I'm from Ottawa, I know the city extremely well. This is the heart of Ottawa, as far as I'm concerned, it's the most urban neighborhood in the city. It's an awesome neighborhood, I love it. Urban neighborhoods just have more life. Opinion. I've lived in the Glebe, I've lived in Old Ottawa South, I'm familiar with Westboro, Hintonburg and so forth. Center town just has something that those neighborhoods will never have. It's just got, it's got this natural kind of rough edge to it. I'm really happy to be here, frankly. What craft beer looks like is really just a reflection of what's happening in almost every other aspect of, of our lives, and that is a retreat to, uh, to local, locally produced, small uh, batch produced um, goods and products, right? It's more appealing to people, I think, to buy things that are made by people they can meet in, in a facility that they can see than it is to just buy a bottle of beer from uh, the beer store. Hi, I'm Rod Hughes. I'm the head brewer at Flora Hall. Yeah, if I was gonna start at a, a large brewery, I'm not sure if I could really do what I'm doing here. I get to be involved in every aspect. I love serving my beer fresh. That's what I really like about this place in particular. I know that when we're serving our beer, it's, it's, at, it's at its peak, right? It's not sitting on a shelf for six months and tasting different than it should. Being in Centertown is awesome. We've got a lot of people that live close by in all directions. Just some really local people too. Like I think we've met, you know, half the people on Flora Street. The biggest thing for me is that everybody's got positive things to say about this coming to the neighborhood. Cheers. Cheers. Yeah, everyone's really enthusiastic and I am as well. So it's, uh, it's yeah, just a great scene here. That's where my heart is, you know, it's, uh, it's, uh, for the love of people I, I work with and uh, and for love of what we're making here, yeah. You know, like I spend just just as much or more time here than I do at home and uh, sometimes it's hard to leave. I just, I, I really love it. So um, yeah, I, I wouldn't do anything else, honestly, after at this point, it's, uh, it's kind of what I want to do for the rest of my life. I've had a few people come into this space and try and pay me a compliment by saying, you know, it feels like I'm not in Ottawa. <laughs> that pisses me off, to be honest, because we're in Ottawa and it's, Ottawa is an awesome place and there's so much here that uh, is worth sort of celebrating and, and uh, you know, is, is, is exciting. What, I, what I'm really happy about, though, is the fact that this building was derelict and empty for 15 years before I bought it and now it's in full swing and it's being used and enjoyed by thousands, well, so far thousands of people. It's certainly my strong belief that this place will be here when I'm dead and gone and it's my strong desire to see that. I mean if this is now a brewery, this is now a gathering spot in Ottawa, I don't need to sell it, I won't sell it, so it should be here for another hundred years because that's, that's the objective here is to build a, a place that is permanent. We're very happy to be doing that in Ottawa. Uh, I wouldn't do it anywhere else to be honest with you. Yeah. <laughs>